You might want to sit down for this one because it looks like Apple's next generation M5 iPad Pro has just leaked way ahead of schedule and not from some anonymous Reddit post or sketchy Twitter source. This time, the leak comes straight from two Russian YouTubers who somehow got their hands on what appears to be a fully functional M5 iPad Pro, complete with benchmarks, a full unboxing, and design footage that looks, well, shockingly real. If this turns out to be legitimate, we're not just looking at another iPad refresh. We're witnessing Apple's biggest jump in tablet performance since the M1 era. So, let's dive into everything we know, what's changed, what hasn't, and what this could mean for Apple's upcoming October launch event. The leak that broke the internet. According to reports from Russian creators Wilsicom and Romancive768, both of whom are known for early tech leaks, the alleged M5 iPad Pro has appeared in full glory on camera. The unboxing videos show a sleek, ultra-thin tablet that looks nearly identical to the M4 iPad Pro launch back in May 2024. At first glance, you might think, wait, that looks exactly like last year's model. And you'd be right. The design barely changes on the surface. The same minimal bezels, the same sharp edges, and the same flat aluminum body remain. But under the hood, that's where the revolution begins. The Apple M5 chip is the star of the show. And if early benchmarks are accurate, we're talking about a generational leap that could redefine tablet computing entirely. Design, the familiar minimalism, continues. Externally, Apple doesn't seem to have made any wild design decisions. The M5 iPad Pro keeps the same flat-edge design philosophy introduced back in 2018 and refined through the M4 lineup. It's still impossibly thin, feather-light, and premium in every sense of the word. However, eagle-eyed viewers notice something subtle. The back of this alleged M5 model no longer carries the iPad Pro branding. Instead, the rear panel shows nothing but the Apple logo, an antenna line, and a single camera module. That might sound minor, but Apple's decision to drop the iPad Pro text could hint at a new branding strategy, perhaps aligning iPads more closely with Macs, where Apple stopped using model names on the chassis years ago. Another possible explanation is that this leaked device could be an early prototype unit, a pre-production model used for internal testing, which often lacks final branding. Either way, this detail alone has already set Apple fans buzzing. The dual camera mystery, what's that second sensor? One of the biggest visual surprises in these videos comes from the front-facing camera setup. The M4 iPad Pro famously introduced the landscape-oriented camera placement for better video calls and center stage tracking. But this new M5 model, it seems to feature two front sensors. In Romancive 768's video, we clearly see what looks like a second cutout at the top of the screen in portrait mode. Now, whether this is another camera or some kind of Face ID sensor array is still unclear. Apple has been rumored to be working on dual orientation Face ID for years, meaning the camera system could authenticate you both in landscape and portrait orientation seamlessly. If this leak is accurate, that's exactly what might be happening here. That said, we haven't seen any actual footage of both cameras being used at once, so it could also be an ambient light sensor or something else entirely. Apple often hides experimental hardware and prototypes that never make it into final releases, so we'll have to wait until the official reveal to be sure. Display, still stunning, but is it OLED 2.0? While neither of the Russian videos explicitly mentions display specs, Several analysts are already speculating that this could be our first look at Apple's next-gen Ultra Retina XDR OLED panel. Remember, the M4 iPad Pro introduced Apple's first tandem OLED display, a dual-stack system offering incredible brightness and contrast. The M5 might take that a step further with improved efficiency, higher sustained brightness, and potentially even better color calibration for professional workflows. It's still a 13-inch display, ultra-slim, and visually breathtaking. But Apple's obsession with display perfection suggests that under the surface, things could have changed drastically. Performance. The M5 chip is a monster. Now, here's where things get really exciting. Wilsicom ran Geekbench 6 on both the alleged M5 iPad Pro and the previous M4 model. And the results are staggering. Let's break down the numbers. 
M4 iPad Pro, 3,718 single-core, 13,324 multi-core. M5 iPad Pro, 4,133 single-core, 15,437 multi-core. That's roughly a 12% increase in single-core performance and a 15% boost in multi-core performance. Impressive considering how efficient Apple Silicon already was. But the real headline lies in GPU performance. The M5's GPU scored an insane 74,568, compared to 55,702 for the M4. That's more than a 30% leap in graphics power, which could make the M5 iPad Pro a legitimate laptop replacement for creatives, gamers, and even developers. Apple's M5 architecture is believed to be based on the A19 Pro chip that powers the iPhone 17 Pro lineup, but with a higher core count and improved thermal efficiency. Built on TSMC's N3P process, it brings faster transistors, better energy management, and enhanced machine learning acceleration, all crucial for Apple intelligence, AI. Features expected to roll out with iPad OS 19. This means smoother multitasking, faster image rendering, and mind-blowing 3D graphics performance, all while using less power. AI and Apple Intelligence, the hidden power of M5. Apple has made it clear, the future of its devices lies in on-device AI. The company's new Apple Intelligence platform depends heavily on local processing power, privacy, and real-time contextual understanding. The M5 chip is expected to feature an upgraded neural engine, possibly with 32 cores, up from the 16-core version in the M4. This would give the iPad an enormous edge in tasks like text generation, photo editing, voice recognition, and more. Imagine this. You sketch something on your iPad, and in real time, Apple intelligence suggests color palettes, compositions, or even turns your rough drawing into a polished concept. That's not futuristic. It's exactly the kind of AI Apple is moving toward. So while the M5 might seem like just another chip upgrade, it's actually the foundation for Apple's next decade of software evolution. Battery and efficiency, the quiet revolution. A big question many are asking is, how does the M5 iPad Pro manage all this power without overheating or draining the battery? According to early reports, the M5 chip delivers up to 20% better efficiency compared to the M4. That might not sound earth-shattering, but in the world of tablets, where battery capacity is limited by thinness, every percentage counts. If Apple manages to keep the same 10-hour advertised battery life while dramatically boosting performance, that's an engineering miracle. Combine that with iPadOS 19's adaptive refresh rate management and new energy-efficient display controller, and the M5 iPad Pro could easily become the longest-lasting Pro iPad ever. Software, iPadOS 19, and beyond. The timing of this leak is no coincidence. Apple is expected to launch iPadOS 19 alongside the new M5 iPads, potentially in October 2025. This version of iPadOS will reportedly integrate more AI-driven workflows, smarter app management, and new creative tools tailored to the power of the M5 chip. Rumors suggest that Apple Intelligence features will finally be fully available on iPads offering personalized assistance, smart writing tools, and generative capabilities that work natively across Notes, Mail, and Safari. Developers could also tap into the Neural API, using the full M5's AI horsepower to create professional-grade creative apps, design tools, and productivity experiences. Connectivity and Accessories In terms of connectivity, expect Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4 bringing lower latency and faster speeds for external devices. While Thunderbolt support might remain exclusive to the 13-inch model, USB-C 4.0 ensures lightning-fast data transfers and external display compatibility. Apple's Magic Keyboard 3 is also rumored to receive an update, with a larger trackpad, better key travel, and possibly haptic feedback for a more Mac-like typing experience. The Apple Pencil Pro will continue to be supported, and some insiders even speculate a new Pencil Air could be introduced, a lighter, more affordable stylus variant. Release date and price expectations. So, 
When can we expect this beauty to arrive? Most analysts predict an October 2025 reveal, likely at a dedicated iPad and Mac event. Apple's launch pattern often follows a rhythm. Spring for entry-level devices and fall for pro. Professional hardware. Pricing, however, is a major topic of debate. The M4 iPad Pro already started at $999, and with the inclusion of a new M5 chip, OLED improvements, and AI integration, we could see the starting price rise to $1,099 or even $1,149. That said, Apple might offset the cost with trade-in deals and bundled Apple One offers to keep buyers hooked into their ecosystem. Should you upgrade or wait? Here's the big question every iPad owner is asking. Should you upgrade now or wait for the M5? If you already own the M4 iPad Pro, you're still in great shape. The M4 is an incredibly powerful machine that'll handle anything you throw at it for years. But if you're using an older iPad Air or M2 model, the M5 might be worth waiting for. With its rumored AI integration, faster M5 chip, and possibly improved OLED panel, this iPad could be the most capable tablet ever made, even challenging laptops and creative workflows. For content creators, digital artists, and developers, that extra performance headroom could make all the difference. Final thoughts, Apple's silent revolution. At first glance, this might look like a small update. Same design, same camera, same minimal changes. But when you dig deeper, it's clear that Apple is preparing for something much bigger. The M5 iPad Pro isn't just about specs, it's about architecture. It's a platform that enables the next generation of Apple intelligence, creative tools, and professional-grade workflows. From on-device AI, 32-core neural engines, massive GPU gains, and OLED advancements, this is the iPad that bridges the gap between a mobile tablet and a true workstation. If these Russian leaks turn out to be real, then Apple's October event might just be the most exciting one we've seen in years. So stay tuned, because the M5 iPad Pro could very well redefine what a tablet is capable of.